the Nuke Building's first floor on any percent and all bosses first trip. This room is trouble. Getting spotted will likely cause a game over. When approaching the door, just crawl in. Doing a 180 spin on the ground is not faster on the first trip due to the required codec call. Pick up the chaff grenades in the top left corner. There is no need to silence your footsteps on any difficulty. If you do not want to do the quick throw, spend your time picking up the grenades. Then, we will stalk this guard until he passes by the elevator. But to go as fast as possible, we want to move towards the stairs guard at the earliest moment and quick throw him. Before we get into the methods, let's look at the unique situation for any percent normal. On any percent normal, you will likely want to pick up the grenades if you are doing Grenade Raven and skipping the Nikita launcher. On any percent easy, there is an alternate pack we can pick up later. I prefer running along the rail to set up the quick throw, but you can be further to the left if you want. Now, let's look at some methods. First, I will show the stop method, one I do not recommend but will demonstrate. Depending on difficulty, we will have to stop at certain spots on the stairs. To go any further than these spots will cause the guard to see Snake. Once you see the guard turn, start moving. On easy, we will go no further than the third step from the top. On normal, we will go no further than the third step from the bottom. There are two issues with this strategy. If you go too far, you will get spotted. The other issue is that Snake must accelerate again. On hard and extreme, we will go no further than the second step from the bottom with Snake's left foot, which is his forward facing foot. Second is the buffer method with two types, analog and d-pad. Let's begin with the analog type. Keep in mind, buffering depends on how you move. There are other ways to buffer besides those shown. On easy, we will equip our chaff grenade immediately. Then at some point during the line to the guard, do a double punch, aka a PP, then a single punch, or P. This will buffer our movement perfectly. On normal, hard, and extreme, we will equip our chaff grenade once we go prone to crawl under the door. Once again, we will do a double punch, P, P, then a single punch, P. Now, let's demonstrate the D-pad type. On easy, equip your chaff grenade immediately. Go up left at the third shadow. You will hold up left to go along the pillars, then go down left after picking up the chaff grenades. On normal, hard, and extreme, equip the chaff grenade and go up left at the third shadow. The starting movement is the same as easy but we will run into the wall by the chaff grenades before going down along it. Remember, you can always buffer more if you want to. These are methods that work for me, but you may want to look into your own methods of buffering. 